My name is Ivano Aiello. I'm a geological oceanographer here, Mount Seleni. This is my lab. You want me to show you around the lab? That'd be great. Okay. Yes. This is a petrographic microscope. It's a microscope that has got some extra things inside, some extra lenses that allow us to look at minerals of different types. This is called a macroscope. And it's to image um, large objects. And everything can be attached to digital cameras so we can record everything we're doing. Those are more traditional um, microscope here. So this secret side of the lab here. So this is actually uh, one of the um, most uh, uh, peculiar machines that we have here in our lab. This is a laser particle sizer. And what it does, it uh, runs grain size analysis. So it measures the sizes of uh, you know, particles very rapidly and very accur accurately. And, um, uh, between uh, two, two millimeters, so sand size, all the way down to 0 0.04 microns. That's like less than a hundredth of a millimeter. On this side here, you can see a spatial station. That's a completely different type of equipment. We do very different things here, obviously. This is a laser-based uh, scanner. And what it does, it produces three-dimensional models of uh, anything. For instance, like if you look at one of the projects in one of my classes, the students were using this machine here to survey the beach at multiple times and create three-dimensional models of the beach. And by comparing this three-dimensional model through times, they were able to uh, calculate how much sand is coming in, is going out, and what kind of oceanographic process controls it. So geomorphology is the science that deals with these kind of things. And this is a really advanced type of equipment. It is all robotic, so it's uh, automated and can be remote controlled from using uh, this kind of equipment. One of its kind, really. We move to the other side of the lab. This is a typical geolab Hi. student. Hi. Hi. Um, so as I mentioned earlier, we collect cores, sediment cores. So we took uh, one of our um, research vessels, the Point Sur, and we collect cores from the seafloor. And cores are plugs of the seafloor and the subseafloor, and then we analyze them. Ivano Aiello is going back in history, um, looking and reading the sediments like uh, pages in a book uh, to tell us something about how the earth has worked in the past. What we are looking at right now is a smear slide of sediments that come from the Bering Sea of all places. So he's looking at the history of water masses in the Bering Sea. We use microscopy to analyze marine sediments and different types of analysis with different uh, pieces of equipment. And this is telling us a lot about how the Bering Sea has uh, formed a connection between the Arctic, North Pacific, and the Atlantic over time. That's what we do. Questions? So this, this, this is cute yeah. Everybody plays with that when they come in. It's the most fascinating thing in here. It's the most fascinating thing in this lab. <laughs> It was a half a million dollar NSF grant that uh, allowed us to buy that piece. Yeah. <laughs> the block maker. <laughs>